Hello everybody. So we are back at Indian Creek in South Dakota. Uh, we're out here gonna look for some rocks and as usual and see if we can find a fair burn if we're lucky and whatever else treasures awaits us. So we got Kim, of course we got Average. And uh, we're gonna take the side by side here and see what happens. Come on, hope you enjoy. Well, we made it to where we're gonna stop and do some looking around here. Um, side by side parked here and just got out. Didn't even quite get settled in. And yeah, sheet of calcedony here. And this almost looks like a big rock that could have something. But what really caught my eye is this guy right here. It looks like it's got some banding. So right off the bat, we might have something here. Looks like there was a bubble gum in it. Look at that. Yep. Since we're right here, let's get it washed off because I am curious. First find of the day and it might be a decent one. Alright. Hold on, I gotta get situated here. You know, I wouldn't say it's a fair burn, but it's got some fortification pockets on it. Pretty neat. Good way to start out. I like it. Looks like a, maybe some kind of jasper or something, maybe. It's got yellows and reds and swirls. Might be kind of neat tumbled. We just had to, we still haven't gotten away from side to side. Had to come back, got hit with a mob of mosquitoes. So we had to get a bunch of bug spray on. Yeah, bugs, yeah. Part of it, I guess. Sheets of Kelsedney. There is one here, 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 there. It's kind of all over. Definitely going to pick some of it up and bring it home and cut it. Check out that prairie agate. Look at the pattern and the reds. That's nice.
Thanks. Guess who's getting a bath tonight? No, look at that. Cockleburs on you now. Look at this. Look at it. Hey. Kim, you're going to have cockleburr duty again. <laughs> you not go ahead. Bubblegum agate. Just a little guy. Prairie agate here with some neat pattern on it. And that works. What do you think? What do you think? No? Well, I approve, so I'm going to keep it. Yeah, that's right. Kim just found this. Some signers on it. Some fortification patterns. Just pick this one up. It's almost got a little bit of a lace agate pattern on it. Right there. A little bit on this side. Kind of around this. Let me throw that in the tumbler. Probably come out really pretty. Hey guys. You come up and see me. Yeah. Look at this. Interesting, huh? I just found this. Yeah. Yeah, kind of interesting pattern on there. I think I just found one. It might just be a little bit of a signer, but I like the looks of it. I haven't picked it up yet. It's on a big rock. Look at that. Right there, a little juicy pocket in the middle of the sign. Oh yes. There's a Fairburn pattern. <laughs> I don't want to scream it out because uh, Kim's way down in the creek, way down there. And she'll be wondering what the heck and... Wow. 
Hold on. I give it a lick. Oh yeah. <laughs> I love it. Yes. That made the day right there. I don't know if it's a fair burn or just a crazy prairie I get yet, but I see something that intrigues me. I think. Well, I believe that's just a prairie egg. Biting flies. I think that's just, yeah, that's just a prairie egg. But that is a crazy prairie egg. That is, look at the pattern and detail. Wow. Uh, pretty nice prairie egg. There's the butte right there. Yeah, that's kind of a pretty one. Fall down. I just found another one. Check it out. <laughs> Inside, but right there. Another shiner. Kind of tired out of breath, so excuse my heavy breathing more than normal. Ooh, this big thick chunk. Yeah, that's worth taking and cutting. Well, it is about 3.30, about the hottest part of the day today, which is not super hot, in a bird. And, uh, but it just sure feels hot. Of course, I'm kind of a 50 degrees type of guy. I like it cooler. I don't like warmth, but hey bird, grief. I'm gonna go join Kim and Abby, rest a little bit, cool off, grab a sandwich. Maybe we'll go for a little trail riding and uh, come back this afternoon somewhere out here and See if maybe we can get lucky and actually find a third one. <laughs> That'd be awesome, wouldn't it? All right. So anyway, back in a bit. Somebody's being very lovey-dovey. All right. Hmm. Anywho, if you come out here, bring Skeeter Scooter, because the mosquitoes out here are insane. 
I just had to reapply because they are hungry and there's a lot of them. And I'm not a free male, you know? They can at least ask first, you know? This gravel on here has just been covered for eons and eons and it's just washing out now. And then you get to looking at it and well there's nabbers but if you look there's a budweiser can and it's like stuffed up in there like it's not it didn't just wash down and lodge itself there like that's so at some point it looks like it was on the bottom and then all this covered it and now it's coming out again i'm not sure which is crazy to me because it seems like that gravel should have been there a long time ago, but I don't know, maybe the maybe the cavemen had blood laser. Can't even get it out. Yeah, a little bit tore it. There's still some in there, but is there a fairburn in there? They, did they hide a fairburn? No. Alright, well I'll go throw it away, I guess. What's this? Hey! Anyway. I'd share that. It's interesting to me. If it ain't the mosquitoes, it's the biting flies. Look at this. Biting flies all over. Sons of guns. Leave me alone. I don't want to be your friend. Unless they would subscribe to my channel. That brings up a good point. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't so you don't miss out on future content. And uh, leave a comment, share it. It all helps out the channel, we really appreciate it. You know, if you darn buggers would go out and find me a Fairburn, I'd give you a free taste and let you have a free meal. Help me out, help you out, you know. piece of wood, vitrified wood, orange, it's pretty. Let's see that down here. That rock is really hot. I should put it in my pocket because it's burning my hand. Ouch! Ooh. You got, this looks like a lace agate type thing here, maybe. Almost. Hmm. So much stuff to look at. I wish it was a tad cooler. But I'm not gonna complain. It's been an amazing day so far. It's not over yet. Little bubble gum make it. Guess what? I gotta kind of hold on. I gotta do this. You know, am I dreaming? Am I dreaming? What's going on here? I spent I don't know how many trips trying to find a Fairburn, even a decent signer, and then I finally found one. And this trip, I've now found three. That's a I don't think it comes through on this side, but oh look at that. Isn't that nice? Oh, focus. Right on. Pretty peri agate. Ah, it's getting late. I'm in the shade of this butte. Kim and Abby are probably going, where the heck is he? He took off again. Now I gotta find my way around. I might be able to sneak up. 
through there, but I'm guessing the other side's probably pretty steep because the creek's there. So I'll have to go around. That's all right. It's still really hot out here. cold. I came from the heist cooler. <sighs> Amazing. All right, continuing on. I think that's doable. Holy crap. I got back in the creek bottom. <laughs> Bad idea. I'm just getting mauled by flies and mosquitoes. They're hungry. I'm thinking they're getting immune to mosquito spray. Oh cow. Anywho, thank you for joining us today. We hope you enjoyed it. We had a great day out here finding three Fairburn signers, Fairburns. I don't know if they're signers or Fairburns. Found quite a bit of other stuff that's pretty neat too. Some lace agates and uh, chert and jaspers, petrified wood. Prairie agates. Prairie agates, of course. <laughs> you and your prairie agates. And um, a couple of sheets of that chalcedony and I don't know, there's just a bunch of stuff to look at out here. We're gonna get our favorites cleaned up and show you at the end here as usual. We hope you're doing well, and we'll see you guys on the next one.
I just got mobbed by mosquitoes and flies. It's like they're immune to insect spray now. Like, there's mosquitoes the size of sparrows, and I'm pretty sure the <laughs> flies were as big as my drone. Uh -huh. And at one point, I heard it like screamed, one screamed at me. It sounded like a red tailed hawk. Maybe it was, sure. maybe, <laughs> maybe it was a red tailed hawk, but scary. Uh huh. I'd run for my life. I almost died. Oh, uh-huh. He doesn't care. We got life insurance. 